today I'm going to show you how to make one of these. So let's get started. Okay, so what you need is you need some scissors, some uh, printer paper, I uh, need plenty, um, black ballpoint pen, um, some clear tape or scotch tape. And something round, something that's something that's circular round. This is going to be for the eyes. So, yeah, that's about it. that's about what you need. Okay, as you can see, I traced out the blueprints already. Man, it was really hard to trace this from the mask. Trace the beak part. We're gonna make the beak part. Beak part first. So, um, yeah, um, stay tuned for this. I already traced it out with, with my pen. Uh, we're gonna be making the beak first. Okay, so, um, let's get started on this. So I got the blueprints. These are gonna be duplicated. We're gonna cut these out. We're gonna make the beak. Okay, so I got them all cut out, ready to go. This is the bottom part. This is the top part. And I'm going to duplicate these by uh, tracing these onto a piece of paper and then cutting those out as well. So let's do that. Okay, so I got one, I got these uh, two top pieces, two bottom pieces. They're going to be taped together. The top piece, for the top part, you want to tape it all the way around the top here. Like so. Tape it all the way around the top. With the clear tape and um, tape all the way around there. As you can see, it's about maybe about six inches long. And um, for the bottom part, you do the same thing, but on the bottom, because here's the top part. It's going to go here, so you want to tape all the way around here. And then once you got both of those taped together, you're going to tape them together as well. But um, Make sure you tape them on opposite sides. Um, yeah, so let me do that and let's continue. Okay, so uh, I got both of these taped together. As you can see, taped it, but left this open. Taped the top part as well. Have that. And next, all we have to do is just put these together, tape them together. So let's do that. So we got the uh, the uh, beak already uh, made. So we got the beak down. Now the hardest part, the mask. Yeah, uh, this mask part here. It's the harder part, hardest part to make. So um, let's get started. Okay, to make the mask, we just have to make this blueprint here and. Uh, this top part's going to go there. As you can see, hopefully this would be a good size. So what we have to do now is, this is a part of mask. This is like a, it's going to be like that. It's that part of the mask. This top part area. We need to make one, two, and then we're going to move on to the bottom parts, the uh, chin area. So I got this tape part here. I'm going to uh, take this and then tape it on like in a slight tint that uh, and tape it on like like so and I'll show you. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take it have it like like that. gonna be like that. It's part of the mask part. The eye is gonna go there. You know we can cut this out, trim it, trim it out, do some trimming. 
Yeah, let's so continue. Okay, so we got this blueprint here, and it's gonna be like, this is gonna be the chin part. Okay? It's gonna be like that. That's the chin part. You'll see how this is gonna go. Um, yeah. Okay, so here's the progress we're uh, going. So I did that, uh, made a duplicate, and um, and I made taped it on the bottom here, so you should try and shape it like this. This right here, I took a piece and I filled in that gap, and I'm going to do the same on the other side. So this is the progress, and I'm going to also cut out a piece of paper to fill in this kind of gap, because that looks kind of weird. But um, the finishing product should look nice, and then I'm going to cut out the uh, the uh, eye holes the to make the spectacles and um yeah so um we'll see how that goes all right so you can already see the mass coming together um yeah um so here's what I did I uh I uh, filled out all the all the gaps and stuff and got that piece is looking better so I kind of pinched that in and did that so that it kind of looks uh, kind of looks a little more flush flush instead of just a wall so um, yeah so I'm thinking all that's left is um, all that's left is to make the eye holes and spectacles and we'll probably move on to the rest so yeah so um here we go okay so the mask is pretty much done yeah so um what I did was I took a strip of paper folded it and used that to support the shape of the mask so did I I also did it in the beak so the beak wouldn't squish um yeah so I did that, and uh, I put uh, breather holes into the beak so the lenses won't get foggy. Uh, I recommend you do that, because if you don't put in breather holes, I believe the lenses will get foggy when you're um, out in the cold night and, you know, maybe uh, trick-or-treating or something. But, um, yeah, I took the round thing, made the frames, uh, took a pen, and colored them black and uh, put some, drew some rivets on the beak to make it look like it's riveted. Um, yeah, so, um, yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you make this. If you make this, please let me know. Uh, share the video. And, um, yeah, so I hope you enjoy.